Welcome to this video. In this video, we are going to enjoy one of the A-level mathematics questions, which reads as follows. Express the following in the form of A plus B, the root of C, where A, B, and C are what? Rational numbers. So this is the expression which they want us to express in this form. Very simple way of enjoying this kind of a question. All right. So the first thing which you must do is you must always rationalize your denominator. Okay. So what do I mean by that? So in short, you are more like going to introduce a conjugate of this denominator here. So we are going to introduce 2 plus root 3, everything divided by 2 plus root 3. Okay. So let me explain clearly on this point. As far as the initial expression was, is concerned, this is the initial expression. This is the question which was given. Okay, this is the initial expression. As far as this expression is concerned, we have not introduced anything new to our initial expression. Because remember that this is just one. Because you can cancel out to give us, to give you what? One. And then that one times this is this which is the same expression all right that's the first thing which you must know the second thing which you must know is what you are introducing here must make a difference of two squares on the denominators of two fractions of these two fractions as you can see two minus root three and two plus root three this is a difference of two squares very simple concept there so this simply means that when you are looking for a number or the expression that you must multiply here, just make sure that you take the same denominator but put or insert a different sign here. Very simple. So I took 2 minus 3, 2 minus 3, this is 2 minus square root of 3. Now instead of writing minus, I replace it with what? With, with what? With with positive with a positive sign i repress it with a positive sign so that it can be a difference of two squares as i've written here okay so this difference of two squares it will be for our advantage as we are enjoying this calculation now let's continue enjoying it to the numerator let's expand so two times two it's four plus two times root three is 2 root 3 and then we come to this one root 3 times 2 is positive 2 root 3 then plus root 3 times root 3 is root 3 times root 3 everything divided by as I said this is a difference of 2 square meaning that even if you multiply them by initial number by multiplying 2 with this and then root 3 with this your calculation it's the same as saying you have got 2 squared minus root 3 squared because it's a difference of 2 squares okay so from here just a matter of us simplifying our numerator as well as as well as our denominator okay so meaning that we are going to have so we have got 4 plus root 3 plus sorry 2 root 3 plus 2 root 3 is the same as 4 root 3, like this, okay? And then here, here, okay, from you on this one. If they say root 3 times root 3, this expression is the same as everything divided by 3 times 3, like this, okay? Of which, if, if you followed me on the previous calculation on the sides, I said we actually express a certain number, in form of a product and then we divided those initial product into this form so this simply means that in short 3 times 3 is 9 so 9 can be expressed as a product in this form thereafter we can separate these three so that they can have each three must each three can have its own what square root so this is the expression which is here so in short this expression here is the same as what root t 9. So it's the same as the square root of 9. Everything divided by, so 2 squared is 4 minus, remember that a square root and square always cancels each other. So minus what? Minus 3. 
like that okay so from there we have got four plus remember that the square root of nine is what is positive three the square root of nine and then we have got plus four root three everything that by four minus three is what it's one like this okay then the only thing remaining now is for us to finish it let's finish it four plus three is what it's seven plus four root three so this is our answer very simple calculation on how you can express any fraction in this form 